So I heard someone refer to using the, the back part of the brain rather than thinking from the front. Mm. Mm. Um, can you elaborate, elaborate like, how do you um, sort of like activate that thinking? Mm. Like, you're obviously not, you don't want to be thinking too much about what you're doing. Mm. So in that respect, is it more of like a meditative state in terms of just allowing it to happen? And, Mm. I don't know. It's a state of presence. It's a definite state of presence. If we're, if we're, for example, you go home today and say, okay, Nima said, uh, do this step, that step, that step, and you start thinking about that as you do a tansa, you're thinking. You're thinking, okay, first thing he said, Taigong, I remember that feeling, and then he did that, then you're thinking here, right? You're analyzing and you're thinking about it. It's the same part you're using when you're calculating something or when you're working or when kids are playing a video game on the iPhones, they're like this now. You call their name and they can't hear you, right? In Hong Kong, people are like that and they're constantly bumping into each other. Pisses Enrico off. <laughs> you can imagine. Bloody <laughs> hell! It comes and writes on Facebook. Anyway, um, so, so we're thinking with here, right? Whereas if you're present, if you're feeling your body, so when I say present, you first start by feeling your, y yourself within the space around you. So feel gravity, balance yourself upright against gravity. You know the range between yourself and other objects, so you can become present. And then from there, within that state of balance, you start thinking about lightly, you start feeling your body rather than think. If Bruce Lee was right, don't think, feel. It's about feeling your body. So if I think, if I think about, you know, uh, Tai Gong, you can see, I don't know if you guys can see, I mean, see if you can see, but if, you, if I, for example, go like this, Tai Gong, think up the spine, my mind is now completely in the front of the head, you know, I'm thinking about it. I'm look focused, but I'm thinking. Now, if I change from that to actually feeling, okay, where am I standing? Tai Gong, and thinking up the spine. So now, to me, it feels like my mind is here. It's like I'm looking with my mind at my spine and I'm, rather, than, rather than here. And this is a very important thing if you're a teacher to be able to see that. If you're trying to have people's eyes, I remember when we first started, you know, the videos, you'll see if the videos of me in 2005, Sigan was correcting here, and I was going, I really want it, you know, it really like that. So of course I'm thinking with here. You know, but you want to be, you want to be, so how to, basically, don't think about how to activate this, I would say, think about how to turn this off. Yeah, okay. Think about that Take meditative away. state. Take away, this is my way, my way, my, my, my way of space, my way of feeling, my way of teaching is always, in my belief, Wing Chun is about subtracting. We, there's already so much things happening here, and so much things happening here, and emotionally, that we've got to go back to, to letting go, let these go, stop thinking, and be present. You know, so it's about subtracting rather than adding to what we're doing. Too easy to Do less. Stuff, isn't it? it is, it is, it is. That's why Sigan would say, don't ask questions. Don't ask questions. In one time he put me in my place, he said, stop asking questions for a while and just practice. <laughs> and that was in the beginning where we were really scared of him. He was like, yeah, put him right there. So we had, an, at the end, we were very, very close. But in the beginning, it was like, oh, Sigan has told me that, so I shut up, you know. And it's funny, but I had the urge to go, <laughs> come back here. And that's actually when I started to improve. And he said, Westerners are much worse than Chinese because he said the Western people you guys want to well, you guys want to know what the target is and work out a way towards that you want to analyze and understand it before you do it but he said because of the Chinese culture yeah, uh, especially in Kung Fu they're told if you say stand here for six hours and do this they do it without asking any questions you know so he would say, he would say uh, sometimes it's the Chinese attitude regarding training is better for this kind of Wing Chun because you just do it you don't you don't analyze read a book go on Facebook ask questions you figure out how to do it by How many Westerners can stand there for six hours and do that? Not too many. Well, exactly. Well